It's like a deodorant, but on steroids. And like, we love that. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be reviewing another deodorant. You all know that I have been on this natural deodorant kick and it was kicking my ass at first, <laughs> but now it's not. If you guys would like to see the review of the newish Mega Babe Cream Deo, then please keep watching. Okay guys, so let me tell you how this started. A few months ago, I decided to try natural deodorants because I've always heard that they're better for you in terms of not having harsh chemicals. Now, I am not someone that's here to tell you what to do with your body. I understand that while I might use a natural deodorant, every other product in my routine is not necessarily as natural. I'm not trying to be Miss Natural Princess. I'm just trying to do my part. And I've always wanted to try out natural deodorants, but I was so afraid because I am a sweater. I also live in the hot, humid South, and those two things mixed with natural deodorant, in my mind, I was just like, <laughs> the agony I would hate to smell all day. So I started off trying the Mega Babes traditional deodorant, the Rosie Pitts one, and I loved it. But as soon as it got into the spring weather, she did not work. <laughs> I had an odor in my underarm. Now I used the detox mask from Mega Babe. I switched different varieties of Mega Babes traditional natural deodorant. None of it worked, so I switched to another brand. I reviewed that brand a few months ago and they have since discontinued that product. So I was on the hunt for a new deodorant and then Mega Babe, perfect timing, they came out with their Cream Deal, which is their daily deodorant with odor blocking AHAs. Now AHAs are alpha hydroxy acids. These are acids that are oftentimes used to help exfoliate one's skin and resurface it, but they also block odor. Who would have known? I've been using this deodorant for probably almost two months and I'm very shocked. So let's get into some of the specs. This is a natural deodorant that contains mandelic acid, lactic acid, and niacinamide. Now those three products I'm very used to using in my skincare routine, but never have I ever thought to use them under my arm. Lactic acid and mandelic acid help to exfoliate your pores and provide really, really smooth skin. And most times niacinamide is used to refine those pores to help draw impurities from them and helps control oil sometimes. Those acids are also supposed to lighten your underarms. I don't think I've really had an intense lightening of my underarms. You will get darkening of certain areas of your body due to hormones, also due to friction. I talk with my hands and arms, I work out. So there's a lot of friction going on in this area. I don't have too much lightening from this product, but I also do wax my underarms and that helps. And one thing that I also want to mention is that it claims that this helps to refine the pores and skin under your underarms. I will say that it does do that. Like I said, those acids that are within this are usually used to exfoliate, but you also get improved skin texture through exfoliating. So that's why I really love a multi-acid deodorant because it's almost like doing, it's like a deodorant, but on steroids. And like, we love that. <laughs> now, one thing that I disliked about the previous cream deodorant with acids that I tried from Necessaire was the application. And I will have to say there is only one con of this product. And for me, it's the applicator and the packaging. Now, this is just gonna be an aesthetic-y thing. I don't prefer the packaging of this. It's very colorful. It's it's bright, it's also very flexible, and so it makes it a little harder to apply just because you really have to squeeze it from the bottom once your tube is no longer full. Also, like you can probably see, you're going to get deodorant that dries up around the applicator, and sometimes that can either come off on your cap and fall in your bathroom, or transfer onto your underarm. I do love this product, <laughs> like I'm making a mess. It works really well, but I don't necessarily care for the packaging, but packaging aside, this product is amazing. I believe it retails for about $14 on Ulta's website and on Mega Babe's website, and it features three ounces. So I think it's a good value for your money. It's definitely a little cheaper than Necessaire's natural deodorant. I do think the packaging is a little, cheaper if you will, but you get a cheaper price as well. So I think it works out. It also does have a slight tea tree lavender scent, which I think is nice. Um, I like it a lot better than eucalyptus just because tea tree and lavender just feel more 
clean feeling to me. Uh, so ultimately, this does help prevent odor. I have never worn this deodorant for 20, I mean, well, I guess technically I do use it for 24 hours. I've never had an odor with this product unless I like didn't reapply it the next day, which I would take a shower and do that anyway. All in all, I love this product. It works really well for me. Now, I always say with natural deodorants, you are going to sweat. I don't find that this makes me feel too wet. It also doesn't control your sweating. It's just not going to make you feel swampy. And that's one of the reasons why I really like cream deodorants because a gel formula in the summertime or even into fall here or spring, absolutely not. So I love the texture. I love the acids that it has within it. I think they really help to block odor a lot better than the traditional Mega Babe deodorant. I don't like the packaging. I love the scent. All in all, do I recommend this product? Absolutely. I think if you've used natural deodorants in the past and maybe they didn't work for you, try this out. I really think the key to having a natural deodorant work for you is having those added acids. Your girl is hot. She has hormones that are up and down and up and down and she lives in the South. I've never had a funky moment. It's really kept me through the summertime and if you can keep me through August in Atlanta, you are a winner for sure. So shout out to Mega Babe. I also did receive this in PR. This is not a sponsored video though. They don't even know I'm making this video, but I love this product so much. So I had to update you guys on my latest and greatest natural deodorant find. I'm a believer. I'm never going back to traditional deodorants with chemicals and aluminum. I really feel like anything that's near this area of my body, I would like for it to be as natural as possible. And the acids in here just really seal the deal in terms of minimizing and eliminating all odor. So for me, this is a winner in my book. I hope you guys enjoyed this little review. Let me know if you've tried natural deodorants, if they haven't worked for you, if they have worked for you. I'd love to know your experience. And if you're in the market for a new product, I would highly recommend this. It works way better for me than their traditional natural deodorant. So yeah, I'm sticking with it. I love you guys so much for watching. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.